just saw this cool old three-story or three-partitioned hotel building here with a very vintage hotel neon sign up front. I thought it was quite fascinating. Some cool artistic elements above the doorways too there. Uh, and it's got all new glass in it. They fixed it up a little bit. And uh, right next to the Michigan Central Railroad Terminal, which you can't really come to downtown Detroit without talking about the Michigan Central Terminal. Thousands of young men went off to war from this terminal during World War One or World War II, I believe. And it's always on the block here to be restored and people want to fix it up. No one wants to see it torn down. It's a huge, huge structure. Sorry about That's the sun, the folks. Better. There we go. It's a huge structure and it's never been fully utilized. I don't think it's ever had offices on the upper levels. It did operate as a train station for quite a few years until it was finally decommissioned. Well, you but, well look at this here. This is look how tall it is, how many offices and how much office space is in there. It's really quite amazing how fancy and elaborate this building is. So there seems to be a lot of confusion with the traffic around this general area here. Yeah. It's almost like a giant roundabout out front here and it's people are stopping randomly and going and it's no, we can get better picture than that. Come on now. Better yeah, pictures? Alright, I think we've got enough pictures of the building. I think it's pretty cool. Who knows if it'll ever be restored or not, but I heard it's in pretty bad shape inside. Careful, watch your door. Well, I did that video about three months ago, and we just found out that Ford Motor Company has purchased the building and is going to make it into offices. Very good news for the city of Detroit and fans of Detroit area historic architecture. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.